outs away from an NL Central Championship. Carlos Martinez in our Chevy call to the pin, his 20th appearance. And if anybody has emerged from the Mejica, I don't say injury, but at least his less work that we've seen, it's been Carlos Martinez. I mean, this is the guy that really has emerged coming out of the bullpen. And you would say that Rosenthal has emerged in one way because he's throwing the ninth, but you would say that Carlos Martinez has emerged as a person of interest for the postseason because of his upside. That like upside, 99. That's part of the upside. <laughs> well, we've talked a lot about how you like guys with plus stuff in October. There's just something about those playoff games where you want to see a guy coming in, bringing it. Yeah, and there's well, there's a few of those guys in the Cardinals bullpen. But from 99 to an 81 mile an hour breaking ball. That's what he's going to have to do to really capitalize on the live fastball that he has. Ooh, just missed the outside 101. corner. 101 on the gun. Junior Lake at the plate. <laughs> Last time the Cubs were in St. Louis, he was getting an extensive look in left field after the trade of Alfonso Soriano to New York. That's the kind of pitch you say it sounded like it was outside. Well, when you have the power arm like this, you can pitch around, you know, mistakes in location. There are times, though, you see that high octane fastball go back out, you know, as teams are pretty easy on centering it. Just with a breaking ball there, but a good effort. Your comments exactly what Mike Matheny said about Waka, how good he was the other night. He said his location was terrific, but even when it wasn't, it didn't really matter because his stuff was so good. A 2 2 pitch, swing and a miss, 100 the gun. There's a good example there, too. He misses location, but he can throw it right by you because this one does have a little movement up. A little hop on that. Top of the strike zone. He gets the strike out. Wow. Again, a reminder, Cardinals hold on and win this game. We'll have the celebration from the clubhouse. Jim Hayes will be down there. Exclusive coverage on Fox Sports Midwest. Starlin Castro at the plate. He's had a good night. Three for three, couple of singles, and a double. But Dan, only batting 247. It's hard to believe for a guy that was racking up all the hits first couple of years. And they signed Ian Rizzo to long term contracts to be the centerpieces of their building project. And you kind of wonder, uh, have they, their growth been retarded? One, two pitch to Castro. Also seen the demeanor of Martinez who has a little better to his game but he's also pitching with a lot of confidence too right yeah now. that's a controlled flare and you can see that sometimes you let that get away from you but I think to have flair and personality I think it's a good thing oh my goodbye oh, how nasty my. was that <laughs> that's not even fair Al no but it uh, gets your attention doesn't it? special little breaking ball look late breaking down on the after a pitch that's running inside, just the way it's uh, designed to be. Tight breaking ball, right in the right spot. Thrown hard. This is the best we've seen him all year long. Well, we've seen a couple times where he, you know, you put the lot of marks behind him. And there's been a couple times when things started going south, he doesn't know how to stop it. Which he should be able to with the good stuff he has. 
Yeah, that up and in. Explode. <laughs> this is one of those times where you back off the mound and you say, which way do I want to strike him out? Curveball? Fastball in? Fast play? Which one do you pick? One, two, and a base hit into center off the bat of Donnie Murphy. So two out hit. But I think tonight, Rick, here's what you're talking about. You're seeing the full complement of pitches from yeah. Carlos Martinez, and you're understanding why the Cardinals are using him in a role that is increasing with importance as we go along. He's earning it. He's earning that role, and you earn it by having command of multiple pitches by being trustworthy. I mean, if you can't trust somebody with the eighth inning, then you can't give it to him. And you're certainly not going to give it to him in October. But if you feel like you can trust him to make good pitches more often than not and high-quality pitches, and we've seen nothing but that from Martinez despite the base hit. Here's a ground ball hit to the right side taken there by I trust him with the eight. Oh, yeah. They can sense it here at Bush Stadium. 7-0 St. Louis. A season defined by you. A season defined by clutch hitting. It's now a championship season. The Cardinals, the 2013 National League Central Champions. postseason trip 13 years the final seven to nothing over Chicago so many things have to go right for a ball club to win you have to overcome the injuries Things that happen that you just can't prepare for, but nobody could have expected to see 20 rookies come up and have such an impact, particularly the young pitchers who have won 36 games this year, those rookie pitchers. This has been a fun ride. And the coaches let them celebrate collectively together first and watched from the Cardinals dugout like proud parents as the players connect and celebrate on the field, and now they join them. And what a great scene this is here at Bush Stadium, and the fans are still on their feet loving it. 2013 NL Central Champions, the St.